Hey, welcome back to Tiny House and Off Grid Resources. Today I'm playing in the garden with electricity and vinegar. If you have a look here, I've been linking up all sorts of different things. Little bits of rusty metal, aluminium strip, copper wire, zinc nails, and burying them in the ground. I've achieved all sorts of voltages over the morning, but I've found that the very best combination is a carbon rod from the centre of a AA or D-sized battery. That's buried just here. Next to it is a galvanised, zinc-coated, six-inch nail. I've connected those to the multimeter, and I was getting an open circuit voltage of 1.6 volts just from a carbon rod this long and a six inch nail using white vinegar as an electrolyte. Prior to that, I tried just ordinary water, even tried a sample of my own urine, but that's too alkaline. We need a mild acid. So after a tubing 1.6 volts open circuit, I've now connected it to my capacitor pack and it's managing to overcome the internal resistance of my capacitor pack and that is charging my capacitor pack. Current voltage, let's have a look, 0.487 of a volt. It's slowly, slowly rising. It started off at 0.42 of a volt about two or three minutes ago and it's just slowly 0.01 of a volt at a time charging up my capacitor pack. So soon I'll be able to connect this to anything I like and run it for an appreciable amount of time. In the meantime, I'm going to go and get myself a whole lot more carbon rods out of batteries, a packet of six-inch nails, and I'm going to build a battery to power my house. <laughs> 